If you've been keeping up with modern tech developments, chances are you already know that ChatGPT is the latest sensation in the world of AI. This AI-based chatbot system leverages natural language processing NLP, to create lifelike and engaging conversations. Everywhere online, people can't seem to stop talking about it, and for good reason. We'll look into ChatGPT shortly, but before we take a deeper look, let's reacquaint ourselves with what is meant by artificial intelligence commonly referred to as AI. Artificial intelligence is a rapidly evolving field that has the potential to transform a wide range of industries and change the way we live and work. At its core, AI is about building machines that can perform tasks that would normally require human intelligence, such as understanding language, recognizing patterns, and making decisions. There are two main types of AI, narrow or weak AI in general, or strong AI. Narrow AI is designed to perform a specific task, such as driving a car or playing a game. It is able to learn and improve on that task over time, but it is not able to perform any other tasks beyond what it was designed for. In contrast, General AI is designed to be able to perform any intellectual task that a human can. While Narrow AI has made significant progress in recent years, General AI remains a distant goal and is the subject of much debate and speculation. One of the key technologies underlying AI is machine learning, which is the process of training a machine to recognize patterns in data and make decisions based on that data. There are several different approaches to machine learning, including supervised learning, unsupervised learning, and reinforcement learning. In supervised learning, the machine is provided with a labeled training dataset, which includes both input data and the corresponding correct output. The machine uses this data to learn a function that maps the input to the output and it can then be used to make predictions on new unseen data. In unsupervised learning, the machine is provided with a data set but no labels, and it must find patterns and relationships within the data on its own. Reinforcement learning is a type of machine learning in which the machine receives rewards or punishments based on its actions, and it learns to optimize its behavior in order to maximize the rewards. One of the key challenges in AI is developing algorithms that can learn and improve over time, rather than simply performing the tasks they were programmed to do. This process, known as machine learning, involves feeding large amounts of data into a machine and using algorithms to identify patterns and relationships within the data. As the machine learns, it becomes better at performing the task it was designed for, and it can even adapt to new situations and environments. Another important aspect of AI is natural language processing NLP which is the ability of a machine to understand and interpret human language. This is a particularly difficult task for machines, as human language is complex and often ambiguous. However, advances in NLP have made it possible for machines to understand and respond to spoken and written language, enabling them to perform tasks such as language translation and customer service. And this is where ChatGPT comes to the fore and excels. Now, let's get into what exactly ChatGPT is. OpenAI, a San Francisco-based AI and research company, launched ChatGPT on November 30, 2022. ChatGPT is an artificial intelligence language model trained to assist users in generating human-like text based on the input provided to it. It has been designed to be able to understand and respond to a wide variety of inputs and can provide information on a wide range of topics. It is optimized for conversational dialogue using something called Reinforcement Learning with Human Feedback, RLHF. ChatGPT is a revolutionary AI assistant that replicates real conversations impressively. It remembers topics discussed, clarifies ideas when requested, and even apologizes if incorrect responses are given. This advanced technology was specifically designed to make interacting with the bot more like having authentic conversations with humans, and it most definitely succeeds in this area. ChatGPT is proving so popular that it acquired 1 million users in its first five days after launch. That's faster growth than Netflix, Instagram, and Twitter when they first launched. How does ChatGPT differ from GPT-3? GPT-3, short for Generative Pre-Trained Transformer 3, is also an artificial intelligence language model, but it is significantly larger and more powerful than ChatGPT. GPT-3 was trained on a much larger dataset and is able to generate human-like text at a much higher level of quality. It is also able to perform a wider range of language tasks, such as translation and summarization. However, like ChatGPT, 
GPT-3 is not able to browse the web or access any new information beyond what it was trained on, so it is limited to the knowledge it has acquired during its training process. How was ChatGPT trained? ChatGPT was trained using a machine learning technique called unsupervised learning, in which a computer is fed a large amount of text data and learns to predict the next word in a sequence based on the words that come before it. Specifically, ChatGPT was trained on a data set of web pages, books, and other texts called the Internet Archive Common Crawl. This data set contains billions of words, and the training process involved using a neural network to analyze this data and learn to generate human-like text. In the process of training, the neural network was optimized to minimize the prediction error of the next word in a sequence, based on the words that came before it. The network was also designed to capture long-term dependencies in the data, which means that it was able to learn the context and meaning of words based on the words that came before and after them in the text. This allows the AI to generate coherent and contextually appropriate responses to user queries and prompts. What is ChatGPT capable of doing? As an AI assistant, it is able to understand and generate human-like text, which means that it can perform a wide range of language-based tasks. Some examples of things it can do include answering questions. It can understand and respond to questions about a wide range of topics, including general knowledge, mathematics, science, and more. Providing information. It can provide information on a variety of topics, including definitions, explanations, and descriptions. Summarizing texts. It can read and understand long texts and summarize their main points or key takeaways. Generating descriptions. It can generate descriptions of images, videos, or other visual content based on what it sees. Translating between languages. It can translate text from one language to another using machine translation technology. Generating text. It can generate original text based on prompts or themes provided by users. It can even be used to write code and create a website in an instant. The uses of chat GPT are endless. One interesting aspect of AI is its potential to improve and augment human abilities. For example, AI can be used to analyze large amounts of data and provide insights or recommendations that can help people make better decisions. AI can also be used to automate routine tasks, freeing up time for people to focus on more complex and creative work. AI has the potential to revolutionize a wide range of industries, including healthcare, education, transportation, and more. For example, AI-powered medical diagnosis systems can help doctors to identify diseases more accurately and efficiently, while AI-powered education platforms can provide personalized learning experiences for students. Overall, the field of artificial intelligence is constantly evolving and has the potential to have a significant impact on many aspects of our lives. It is understandable for people to have concerns about the potential impact of artificial intelligence AI, on society in the future. However, it is important to recognize that AI is a tool, and like any tool, it can be used for good or for harm. Whether or not AI should be feared depends on how it is developed, deployed, and used. It is important for those developing and using AI to consider the potential consequences of their actions and to ensure that AI is used ethically and responsibly. This includes ensuring that AI systems are transparent and accountable, and that they are designed and used in ways that promote fairness, equality, and respect for human rights. At the same time, it is important to recognize the potential benefits of AI, which include increasing efficiency, improving decision-making, and helping to solve complex problems. By approaching AI with caution and care, it is possible to harness its power for the good of humanity. If you would like to get your first taste of using AI technology, and would like to explore the capabilities of ChatGPT, you can open any web browser and navigate to chat.openaid.com to get started. OpenAI have made it really simple to use. That concludes our video on ChatGPT. We hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please consider subscribing to our channel. Thanks, and until next time, goodbye.